This is Universal Studios, the largest and busiest motion picture and television facility in the world. Movies such as The Sting, Airport and Earthquake have all been made here. But this is more than just a major motion picture studio. This is the third largest tourist attraction in the nation. More than 30 million people have visited here just to see how movies are made. Twenty thousand people a day take the Universal Studios tour, a two and a half hour guided adventure that takes you behind the scenes of movie sets, haunted castles, faraway galaxies, and the ever popular special effects stage. If you ever wondered how they danced on the ceiling as Fred Astaire did in 1951 for the movie The Royal Wedding, this is how they did it. It's all an illusion. The room is built on its side and the camera can turn on its side. Not all special effects are done with two-legged folks. Some are two-legged with feathers. This is Fred, the cockatoo star of Beretta, appearing at the Animal Actors stage. Hello. and I get up here and take a big bow. Steve Behrens is the animal trainer. You trained a bird to fly to someone in the audience. Well, they're, they're so tame that, uh, that that just doesn't bother them. They, uh, they really trust everybody, I guess, you know, because of, of the amount of time we've put into them. Now, we never punish our animals. We, we repay them. We reward them. This is Johnny, or as you know him, Boomer, from the television series Here's Boomer. As you can see, we just pulled him out of makeup. He hasn't got his total haircut yet. Now, he's going to mail a letter for you. And this took about five little behaviors all put together to create the, the mailbox, what we call it. Come on over here, Johnny. Hurry up and mail this. Hurry. That a boy. Put it all the way up. Put it all the way up. That's a good boy. Come over here. That a boy. And that's all there is to it. On the tour, witness Universal's version of the parting of the Red Sea. stay dry during the parting of the Red Sea, careful around the flash flood. Wondered how Lily Tomlin looks so small in the movie The Incredible Shrinking Woman? Big props like this giant shopping cart. Holds a lot of food. Jaws is one of the most popular attractions here at Universal Studios, but you want to see what he looks like out of the water? Here he is, Bruce the Mechanical Shark. It's all done hydraulically and electronically. This is the western area of Universal Studios. Westerns such as the Virginian, alias Smith & Jones, and Wagon Train have all been shot here in this here street. But I'll let you in on a secret. See this brick wall? Watch this. Soft, foam rubber. This is to protect the actors when they fall upon the wall from hurting themselves. Hollywood stuntman Steve Gillum. It takes a lot of rehearsal to get it down, especially to make it look like it's real, to sell it to the audience, and to be able to do it over and over and over and not get hurt. When you can see for yourself the thrills and spills of movie magic, you understand why Universal Studios is one of the biggest tourist attractions in the country. 
Where else can you get a close-up look at how the film industry really pulls their punches? Now, a fight for the motion picture camera, the stomach punches are contact punches. Pop the stomach with the fist. At the same time, the man tightens up the stomach. This helps protect him from that punch. Now, the face punches are thrown several inches away from the face. Right here is the distance. You can be that far away. But with the camera in the right angle, it will look like a hit. That popping or thudding sound that you hear will be added to the soundtrack later. So we'll put these together so you can see what it'll look like with the right camera angle. Set. Yep. <laughs>